lesson 116 of the third review of A Course in Miracles. Welcome to the Qigong support for A Course in Miracles students. I am Judith and you're at the Lucid Mind Center. First, we're going to do a Qigong alignment to get into the zone, to get ready for our Course in Miracles lesson. And that Qigong alignment is going to take a couple of minutes. Then we are going to read the lesson together and contemplate it. And after that, I'm going to guide you to, to a Qigong class, which I have recorded specifically for this lesson. After the lesson and after the class, I would love you to give me some comments and let me know how this was for you. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so more Course in Miracles students can find me. And let me know where you're watching from and how long you have been with A Course in Miracles. So let's align ourselves with our higher self. So for that, you can come today again to the edge of the sofa, to the edge of your chair. And I'm going to guide you through what you're going to do. Just trying to align ourselves with this holy self of ours. So the first thing is imagine that you're growing a tail into the earth and then you just wag your tail. Very good. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. Imagine that you're growing the roots from your feet into the earth as well. Very good. And last one, inhale through the nose and exhale through the mouth. And just let go of the things which are not serving you. Today we're just going to wake up our meridians in the hands because we're going to be working, connecting with our heart. So we just want to connect with our heart today before we are connecting with our Holy Spirit, with our Holy Self. Very good. You're going to feel, you can feel the tingling sensations on your arms. Nice. And then we're going to lift up the hands. You have, we've done that already a few lessons ago. You just lift up your hands and lift up your heels, bring them up, and then exhale down. And this time, turn your hands around, lift your hands up again, lift the heels, inhaling. Now sink the legs down, sink the heels down, and now lift your toes. That's it while you exhale. And now inhale. Lift your heels, exhale, lift your toes. Again, inhale, lift your heels, turn your hands around, sink your heels, and now lift your toes, toes as you're exhaling. And last one, in and ex. Very good. Now remember, the central channel, which is coming up from the, parent, from the crown of your head, is connecting to the heavenly force. And then remember the channel coming out of your perineum into the earth. So you're just connecting to this channel and you can just squeeze your perineum three times. Inhale, and then bring it all the way up to the crown and then exhale and bring the energy of the heaven all the way down into your into your perineum so you're kind of inhaling and exhaling now inhale and exhale and again inhale squeeze the perineum bring it up to the to the crown of your head and exhale and last one, in and exhale. And here, stay here for a minute and feel that connection between yin and yang. Feel that connection between the heavenly force and the earth force. And remembering that your body is a conductor of energy, is a conductor of light. And now bring the hands down into prayer position right in front of your chest. Open up and exhale. One more. In 
and actually we're gonna open up our heart because this lesson today is connecting to happiness and joy and to the highest human potential of unconditional love and exhale very good notice your connection from above and below notice that you are a conductor of light remembering that you have got a special function here very good and now lean back now lean back on your sofa or sit back make yourself comfortable to read our lesson together lesson 116 god's will for me is perfect happiness this belongs to lesson 101 god's will is perfect happiness for me and i can suffer but from the belief there is another will apart from his and then the second idea is i share god's will for happiness for me i share my father's will for me his son so we are the children of god we are the son of god there is no gender or sex in this uh, in the course of miracles we are just the creation of the creator we are the created i share my father's will for me his son what he has given me is all i want what he has given me is all there is so this particular lesson is about happiness and joy and is to remember that this is what our creator is willing for us and when we start willing that for ourselves as well then things change in our perspective on life and the thing which is not allowing us to feel that this is the fear within us which is manifesting itself as the ego which is manifesting itself in the way that we hold on to it because we feel we need to protect ourselves according to the ego rules so if somebody hurts us we need to hurt them too if somebody takes something away from us we need to give revenge or we need to make sure to protect ourselves so nobody can hurt us and nobody can steal something from us but this is not what we are here for we are here to be happy and joyful and to share this happiness and joy and joyfulness with the world to light up with our with our presence of remembering who we truly are and as we are remembering and as we are living this remembrance if you will then we are giving permission to others to do the same it's the ego which is censoring us it is the ego which is saying who do you think you are to be so happy all the time if people see that you're happy they're going to wish you bad and they're going to do things to you but remembering that we are all in this together we are all humans here to wake up so god's will for me is perfect happiness and i share god's will for happiness for me so let's contemplate these ideas today in this qigong class which i have recorded for this lesson here you have got a list for all the qigong classes which are specifically recorded for uh, course of miracle lessons and here you have got the all the course of miracle lessons enjoy and let me know how it goes for you